All right, so um, we're gonna talk about a Baker cyst, something simple, something easy. A Baker cyst is a soft tissue mass found in the posterior popliteal posa, in the back of the knee. It is uh, the most common mass found in that portion of the knee, and the incidence anywhere from 10% to even 58% of people will have a popliteal uh, cyst called Baker cyst. Usually results for intra-articular pathology, something wrong with the knee, uh, basically creates a leak of synovial fluid into a bursa, creating that cyst. And uh, obviously, therefore, it's almost associated with some kind of joint pathology in up to 90-something percent of all the cases. What kind of problems? Meniscal tear, ligamentous injury, arthritis of the knee, and even osteochondral, bone joint with the uh, ligaments and joint kind of thing. In kids, it's not necessarily pathological. My boy had one, and we even ended up doing an MRI because the ultrasound showed some calcification suggestive, you know, could be something else because it's not typical to have calcifications within the cyst. MRI ended up being negative, and the cyst kind of went away on its own. Um, the ultrasound is 100% sensitive and 100% specific, so it's the one study that you have to do. And the treatment is um, ultrasound-guided aspiration. You don't want to do a blind aspiration because it could be a aneurysmal. Uh, arterial and then you get blood all over the place so so you don't want to do that uh, fenestration and um, uh, steroid injection you can at the same time you aspirate you leave the needle in and then you inject some steroids in and that helps kind of take care of it and all the inflammation it's important that of course it's a mass in the posterior part of the knee to consider DVT in the differential diagnosis but that's fine because you do the ultrasound for DVT you go down there in the knee and you see a well circumscribed cyst and it's just a popliteal cyst and you're done so that's it, Baker's cyst. Where's our bow tag?